Yeah. Okay, go for it. Okay. So each of these boxes is one of our um, open BTS based hybrid VoIP GSM base station units. The top unit is really a test unit. It's, it's designed to run special test applications. This unit is going to go on another van similar to this one at 9 o'clock and B. It's just in the rack for storage. This one's going to be operated from this van over by center camp. So in each of these units you really have three connections that matter. You have power which is 12 volts. You can go straight to a car battery. The antenna which presents a normal looking GSM signal. Uh, five GSM channels on each box. And the ethernet where we present the calls as uh, SIP calls. So the handsets through the ethernet connection, the handsets just look like SIP endpoints in a VoIP network. And that uh, really simplifies your network and all the radio resource management's internal. This box runs our telephone switch and our subscriber database and our text messaging server. This is not our box, this is for med medical imaging stuff over at the uh, medical camp. This box is going to run some special um, telephone and SMS based applications uh, provided by a company called Voxeo as part of a cooperative project. Um, some applications we think, you know, hopefully people think they're fun. I'm not even sure what they are yet. I haven't had a good chance to coordinate with them, but I know they've been working a lot. That's a satellite modem. These two boxes are part of the satellite tracking to keep the antenna aligned. This is the um, IP router and firewall, Ethernet switch, UPS. Power supply is on the bottom. So each, yeah, each one of these boxes will present about 35 subscriber lines of capacity and only draws about 220 watts, which compared to conventional cellular equipment's pretty and low power. this is the... Yeah, the big thing is a satellite antenna. It's not deployed yet. And then um, at the end of the van, there's a push-up mast, and that's where we're going to put our, uh, our cellular antenna. It's on that push-up mast. It only uses one antenna? It doesn't use a... No, we're just running Omni. Just, we're running it doesn't you have a transmit and receive? No. It runs everything through one antenna. Yeah, no, we have a. There's a duplexer built into the box. We can run it out of one antenna. For most of the people we work with, right? Most of our current customers like, um, you know, sort of rapidly deployable, real simple systems. Uh, you, for for that sort of world, uh, single antenna is a lot easier to work with. You don't have to run half as much cable. You don't have to mount half as many antennas. Cool.